What's going on, guys? Clutch here once again. Welcome back to Felsbrand. We have just got a call. Our truck has been fixed. DJ, you owe me. <laughs> Send me some cash. I am broke. Look at my bank account. Minus 160 bucks. That's awesome. Uh, we got a worker working over on this field right here. He is planting wheat. Yeah, wheat. I've got a plan for the day. I'm going to make some money back right about now. Well, not now. Soon. Soon, soon, soon. So, we pick up this truck. Um, yeah, we'll leave their truck right here. You can use his truck again. Thanks for letting me borrow that farm truck. I don't mind the Dodge. It's not bad, but uh, compared to the Chev, it is not good. <laughs> this, uh, yeah, this Duramax diesel. Oh, this thing is awesome. Anyways, I'm glad to have this truck back. This truck is a little bit more useful for me. And I think it looks a little better, too, to be perfectly honest. Good farm truck. Anyways, we're going to take care of that. We've got some fun stuff going on today. We need to do some big selling to get some money back. So let's go sell some stuff. I need to do a little bit of landscaping first, though. I need to fix something. So i got to take some money out, and uh, we'll figure that out next. All right, let's do it. Pitter-patter. Clutch Simulations. All right, all right. All right, so this here is our silo, guys. This is the problem I'm running into. Now, I kind of want to do, I want to sell some stuff, obviously. Um, I don't need to get onto this side. I only need to get onto that far side over here to load up my tippers, which is good and fine. But trying to get out and down the road here is a pain. If you saw uh, one of my recent videos, I got stuck on all these lampposts. I want to make a road that just comes straight down here. I want to edit this down so that I can actually get on the road right here. So I'm going to do that. Let's get out of the way and do some editing. Let's do some landscaping. Uh, boom, landscaping. I took out a little bit extra cash for this because um, I don't have any money, <laughs> I'm broke. So I took out a loan for some landscaping, that's okay. So we want some sculpting and we want to, uh, should we flatten? We want to flatten this. I hope this is gonna do the right, there we go, flatten. Flatten and then smooth. Hopefully I can smooth this out so it gets back off the road. Come on, get off the road for me. I don't want you on the road. So that's, uh, yeah, I just flattened it out. And now that's uh, going to be a bit of a pain. So let's, oops, I need to flatten that once more. So I need to get, I'd like to get rid of this stuff. And it's always a bit of a pain I find once it gets on, um, on the road itself. Let's see. There we go. Okay, now... Uh, that's been flattened. Let's smooth this all out. This is going to be a bit of a fight. Uh, it shouldn't be too bad there. Perfect, 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 perfect. Okay, and we'll get it right up against the road. Flatten, smooth and smooth and flatten, flatten and smooth. So I think, I'm thinking the tipper should be able to come up here now. It's going to be a bit of a rough ride through here. I might, um... Uh, yeah, you know what? We still want to have access to be able to do a kind of a roundabout in there. I might just make a gravel or something. I don't know yet. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Okay, so we've gotten that done. Now let's just do a quick paint job and get some concrete down on this. Uh, is that the concrete? So I usually just try and put it side. That doesn't look like it, but it is. There we go. Perfect. And now we have a nice little access area. So our tippers should be able to drive up this. It actually looks a little bit nicer than this, to be perfectly honest. Uh, yeah, that's actually not bad. All right, I'm happy with that. So that was a quick little um, flattening area that we did. Look at that. That looks great. Yeah, perfect. All right, so this is going to work just fine. Now, let's just see. We'll be able to drive through. Yeah, that looks good. Perfect. So next I need to get my tipper. Now... We're going to try and do this in one load because, you know me, I don't like to do extra trips if I don't need to. <laughs> uh, yeah. So, um, let's pull one of the trucks out of the way here. We'll get this one moved out. We'll hook it up to uh, the... Uh, what truck is that? What trailer is this one here? Uh, this one right here. What is it? The P trailer. I can never remember what you want to call it. I want to call it the silage trailer, but it's not the silage trailer. What's the word I'm looking for? Uh, anyways, I'm hooking it up that one. I'll think of it in about five seconds, I'm sure. Uh, it's not the manure. What is the word I am looking for? Anyways. All right, let's hook this one up right. 
Leute hier. Ja, noch. Und dann. Wow, 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 wow. I just lost her there. Boom. Perfect. Okay. Oh, look at this. I could tow this trailer with this truck. <laughs> uh, no, I want this one. Boom. Okay. Move this out of the way. This truck will actually tow um, that flat deck or that trailer. It'll back right underneath of it. It shouldn't connect to it, but it lets you do it for some reason. Kind of funny. Um, unrealistic, but kind of funny. <laughs> okay. Now, next, this one here is going to go and connect into that, and we will have our B train ready to rock and roll. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Boom. Awesome. All right, we are good to go. Now, let's see if I open that one and open this one. Awesome. Let's go load these bad boys up. Let's see how we make out around this corner this time. Oh, this is a fight, though, with the double... But, you know me, I'm lazy and I want to do it in one trip. <laughs> Did I get around the corner? Kinda? Okay, let's keep our speed up. Now, we gotta do this at a little bit of speed. Hopefully we can get around this corner, but you want to take it wide, 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 wide. Wide, 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 wide. Come on, baby, get up that hill. Oh, darn, lamppost. <laughs> um, okay, plan B, plan B, plan B. I got another plan, I got another plan. I'm good. Let's do our new road, because we can't make that corner. But I should be able to make this corner. Right? And then up. It's not fantastic, but it works. Watch out, Pooch. Watch out, buddy. And then wrap it around. What did I hit? Oh, I hit my house. I hit the farm. The farm building. <laughs> Crank this right on over. <laughs> All right, come on. As long as it, oh, it's not going to make that turn. Oh, I did not design this farm with plans of having doubles. Come on. Definitely did not have plans with designing this for doubles. Oh. How much damage would I be doing to my trailers right now? Okay, plan B it is. Uh, let's disconnect that one there. So we'll only have this. And we'll load these up individually, and then we'll reconnect. All right, let's do it that way. All right, so it just proves that when maneuvering doubles around the silo, I'm going to have to separate them. Ah, oh, that's annoying. Anyways, um, it's good that I got this truck back. <laughs> uh, wheat. You know what? I don't have enough room. I thought I'd have enough room, and I don't. Uh, you know what, maybe I can actually just kind of maneuver this out of the way once it's full. We'll see. Uh, let's see. Okay, that's there. It's full. Let's see if I can just get my truck around the side of the trailer. There we go. And wheat. Perfect. So we've got so much wheat. Look at all the wheat we got. Yeah, baby. All right, um, I need to drop that. We can put this over here, I think. Put it beside for now. All right, let's see if I can. <laughs> the front tires are off the ground and they can't eat. <laughs> All right, so I need to back this. Come on, but let's go back up to that trailer now. Connect. All right. All right. See, we are good to go. Excellent. Oh, that's awesome. I'm loving the look of these trailers. They just look so good. Anyways, enough of me... Oh, I need to turn this off. Um, enough of me looking at my equipment here. Let's uh, get some roofs on these things. Oops, this one. And this one. Nope, I already did that one. This one. Okay. Um, now, I thought it said the east silo was the... Uh, once again, the best one to go to. Which one is the east? It looks like Grain Elevator East, so that's down over the tracks. Okay, we can do that. That's not a problem. Let's rock and roll. Oof. Oh. Yeah, we're okay. We're okay. We're okay. Oh, maybe we're not okay. Come on, baby. Get around that lamppost. Oh! <laughs> we did it. We're okay. It's all right. Look at the lights on this thing. That's cool. Better turn our signal on here. 
I can't see anything. Wow, that is impressive. All right, let's get out of here. Now I need to take this super, super wide. Oh, sorry, car, but I'm blocking you off. Is it going to hit the sign? Oh, I'm definitely taking out signs. Oh, man. Look at this car. What are you doing? <laughs> okay, on the road. I don't know how much speed we're going to get. We're fully loaded. Double tandem. 120,000 liters? I think it's liters. I don't know what, what that's in. Oh, my signal on still. Um, where do I want to go? Oh, this way. I want to go this way. <laughs> where, where do I want to go again? Okay. Uh, I need to double check this map. Yeah, we'll go this way here. No, I'm not going to make it the long way around this. I'm just going to cut this corner just a touch. Don't mind me. We just got a massive trailer in Europe and they got tight roads here. <laughs> a little bit unrealistic. <laughs> That's okay. Uh, I'm not getting much speed though. I like 40 kilometers an hour. That is me maxing out. Um, I wonder how many of these I could tow. Fully loaded. <laughs> I'm having a tough time just keeping it on the road. Oh, go first person. <laughs> I don't have to worry about my trailers on first person, right? It's not behind. If you don't see it, it's not behind you. Oh, we got a traffic circle. Ooh, I didn't think about that. Okay, we're gonna try and go around the traffic circle. We're gonna go. We're gonna live by the books today. Think we can do it? Oh, I can't see anything. Ah! Oh! Oh! <laughs> uh, come on! Go around the traffic circle. Come on! Get up as far out as we can. <laughs> that second trailer is like in the flower bed. <laughs> oh yeah all right we're good we made it through i don't think they planned these roads uh to have what i'm pulling through here <laughs> uh, we do have to cross some tracks now i have seen a video recently of someone who got stuck with some tandems on the tracks oops another sign oh dude so many signs so many signs all right Come on, get up there. Climb that hill. Um, so this here is going to allow us to buy something new. Once we get some money for this, I got a plan. Like I said, we need some TMR for our cows. Yes. Oh, there's no way I'm going to make that corner that well. Oh, no train, no train, no train, no train, no train. Oh, good. <laughs> uh, nervous, nervous, nervous. Get over there. All right. Perfect. Uh, all right, let's see. So we will start the old dumperoo skis here. Dumperoo! Boom. First one. Awesome. Let's see what we get out of this. So, like I said, we were broke when we started dumping these. Um, I have no idea how much money I'm going to get out of this. Uh, is it this one? Nope, that's not it. Uh, I can never remember. There it is. Next one. Put the lid back on. There we go. So that's almost a hundred grand per trailer. Well, it's eighty. What thirty? That's sixty thousand per so far. Okay. Uh, now the price is probably dropping pretty rapidly. Um, actually, let's see if it's twenty-eight thousand again. What is it this time? Twenty-eight thousand. Perfect. Okay. And then we will go one more. Boom. So that's going to be, yeah, almost 100 grand. That's got to be over 100 grand. 30, yeah, 30 times 4. Duh. $120,000. Perfect. Excellent. That's not bad. Um, I do have a problem now. How on earth am I going to get out of here? <laughs> I didn't think of that. All right. Well, um... Think you can back up a, a double B here? Let's, no, there's no way I'm going to be able to back that up. There's no way I'm going to be able to back that up. Okay, we're going to try the old spin around. I don't think this is going to work. In fact, I'm about 99% sure it's not going to work. Ah, come on, let's see. Crank it right over, crank it right over. It might just shoot me off into the woods as we spin around. Come on. <laughs> Whoa! Got rammed up in there. That's all right. It's all right. We're okay. It's still good. It's still good. Yeah, baby, we did it. Perfect. Let's get out of here. 
I'm just bashing my trailers everywhere. It's okay. It's okay. Uh, no train, no train. Boom, 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 boom. Okay, so I've got 140,000 of, well, it's not play money, but um, I've got a plan. I've got a plan. Got some stuff I need to buy. Uh, yeah, it should be good. I'm going to take out some more money and buy some more equipment. It should be good. Anyways, let's get down to it. I can't wait. All right, let's do it. All right, guys. So we took out some more money. And we've bought in some new toys again. So all the money we just made off all of that wheat that we sold off. Um, that was good, but it wasn't enough. So what do I got here? Well, Clutch, what do you got going on there? Well, that is a square bale wrapper. Now, what else will I need if I have a square bale wrapper? What else do you guys think I'm going to be doing here? Well, you know I've been talking about getting the mixed, uh, the TMR for the cattle. So I can bump their productivity up all the way. So I need to make some silage. I need to cut some grass. That's what we need to cut some grass. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the big M. Uh, I've been dying to use this. And uh, we got some grass to cut. Oh, yes. Yes, sir, we do. Now, unfortunately, it's going to be a bit of a process. Um, I wish you could drag. I wish I had a PTO so you could drag a baler behind this. But you cannot. So I need to cut grass. I need to bale grass with a baler. And then I need to wrap the grass into silage. Make sense? Makes sense all to me. <laughs> All right, let's go to the field and start cutting some grass. Let's do this. Uh, I am excited. This thing is awesome. Now, I did mess this thing up at one point in time fairly recently. Well, not too recently back. As it, when this game first came out, um, I guess I could do this field. I'm not going to bother. There's a nice big open grassy field just down the way here. Now, what I didn't realize with this the first time I was using it is that it defaults to putting grass everywhere, which is kind of annoying. So, um, and the, to change the swath, uh, or the windrow on this particular device is a little bit different. I'm going to lower this down. I'm going to show you exactly what I mean. Now, I'll bring up the tooltip so you guys can see this, because it caught me off guard as well. And I've taken a little bit of heat for this, to be honest. And, hey, rightfully so, rightfully so. Um, so I'm going to start this up. And now I'm going to drop this down. Now... You see on the top left there where it says selected work mode wide spreading. We don't want that. It's just going to put grass everywhere and you would need to wind roll it later. If you hold down your right bumper and then your left thumbstick on, well, this is Xbox controller, mind you, um, it's going to change to swath, swath dropping. You can go left swath, right swath, whatever you want. Pretty handy. Now I'm going to go left. And I'm going to see if this is going to work. I don't know if it is. I haven't tested this yet. And well, it usually helps if you have the vehicle running. Okay, let's go. So it should all come. Uh, boom. It usually helps if you have it st that started too. So all the grass should, in theory, go left, I'm thinking. Oh, no. See, it doesn't. I was hoping that it would be uh, more. So your best bet is still going to be center, unless for some reason you want that. Which I don't think any reason why you would want to have that. So it's going center and right for whatever reason. That doesn't make any sense to me. If someone knows why you would want that, let me know. Um, I'm going to go straw right in the middle. Keep it simple. There's no reason for me to have that. That just makes extra work. I was hoping I could do it all off the left side of the track of the uh, vehicle and then spin it around and then go do right side of the vehicle as I'm coming back or whatever. Anyway, it wouldn't be, it'd be still left side technically, I guess. And that way, all my, my droppings would be like piled up for two full passes. And I could fill a bale up in next to no time. But um, anyways, this is, this is fine. This is fine. So, we're going to do a few laps of this. I'm going to do, I'm going to do this field, I think. and got a bunch of grass. I don't need too many of the... Um, like, all I'm doing is making those bales, like I said. That is it. So, I don't need too, too many. If I can get... Yeah, if I could get a full truck, so it would be eight bales, that would be probably enough to last me for quite a while. Um, oh, this thing is so awesome, though. This thing is cool. So anyways, if you're having some issues with the uh, the grass droppings, take a look at the tool tips. Like I said, that caught me off guard the first time. I didn't read that little text. And usually it's not that button that does everything. It's a bit of a different keystroke in order to change the dropping at least on the controller it is i'm not sure about on the keyboard since i don't play on keyboard um well i do play on keyboard but i don't really use it for the most part i just try to stick with the controller 
Anyways, we're gonna wrap this up. Ah, not quite, but close. We'll start, we'll start wrapping once we make some bales. Ah, ha, ha. Yeah, we'll get the, this finished up and then we will bale whatever we can here. See you guys in two seconds. All right, guys. Well, we have cut some grass. We cut a rug. No, we cut some grass. Um, let's get some bales going here. Uh, need to unfold. Oops. Let's get that unfolded. That might help. And that started again. <laughs> I always do that. Okay. And off we go. I'm hoping we get, like I said, I, all I need is eight bales and I'll be happy. I'm sure I can get eight out of this. I, in fact, I'm 100% sure I'm going to get eight out of this. I might get double that by the looks of things. We'll see. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. It's tough to say. I thought we got about four per wind row with straw. Oh, speaking of straw. <laughs> I got a straw bale in the middle of this. Darn it. <laughs> I forgot about that. That is the one problem with this baler is that, uh, yeah, you have to fill up. And I always thought it would cover up whatever that one was, but I guess not. Um, so that's gone. That's too bad. I was hoping they would all be, all be grass, but uh, obviously not. Got one straw bale and it's going to be going back to the shop with us. Um, so it's a bit of a process for this because I need to do everything kind of separately. Um, now, if I had a certain mod like Follow Me, perhaps, uh, I could have someone driving behind me, or a multiplayer, I could have someone driving behind me and wrapping the bales as I went. That would be great. Wouldn't that be great? But um, that's not an option right now. So I've got to do this first, bale it, and then wrap it, and then come and pick it up. So it's a three-step process after cutting it. And cutting it's even a process, obviously. So anyways, we will uh, keep on doing this off. I've got eh, not too, too much. So should, like I said, we should get about eh, eight. I'm hoping now I've gotten, what, three there? I've got, oh yeah, i got lots of bales coming. We should be good. We will be more than good. Not a problem. Not a problem at all. Uh, yeah, perfect. All right, so we'll finish this up, and we'll get that we'll get that wrapper and see how that works. So I have not tried the square bale wrapper yet in this. I hope it works all right. Let's give her a shot. Perfect. So we've got a bunch of bales made. We just need to wrap them. Now let's see how this is going to work. I have zero clue. I have not played with this yet. I hope it works as designed. Perfect. Let's see. I'll get out and watch this thing. Oh yeah, that's slick. That's slick. Okay. So far so good. Okay. Now I'm assuming I have to jettison it just like the other one. Um, um, um hmm. that's I can jettison the whole trailer. What is the key for that? Okay. I don't know what the button is. I don't know what the button is. Uh, unload. There we go. Thank you. Drop. Perfect. Okay. So that's why. I didn't know what button that was. Perfect. Interesting. I like it. Seems simple enough. Just take your time, pull up beside it, and let it do its thing. Now, this is a little time consuming, mind you, to watch each one of these, but it's no different than the round bales. And the square baler does tend to make bales a lot faster. It's a lot easier to pick them up. And I'm going to get eight bales uh, loaded onto a trigger rather than just no, 16 instead of just 8, which is quite a bit different. No, sorry, 8 instead of... Yeah, anyways, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> I did like the square bales a little bit better because they're faster. Awesome. So I'm going to finish all these up, guys, and then I do need to make some hay bales as well. Finish off getting all this grass collected, and we should have some food for our cows for tomorrow. Looking all good around here. Looking all good indeed. Anyways... Guys, uh, this is going to end it for today. Uh, thanks so much for stopping by and joining me today, as always. If you did enjoy this video, guys, make sure you do hit, a link, hit the like button. And, of course, if you're not a subscriber, guys, don't forget about that as well. Uh, this button. Boom. All right. Go. Anyways, guys, thanks again. We will see you guys next time. As always, this has been Clutch. Over and out.